Hey y'all, it's Ashley and I am here with the Saturday Stash Dive and I am doing this with Carla who is also Capamia and our challenge this week is using inks or paints and so I'll go ahead and um, get right into it. I started off with, I have this little acetate piece that I use in place of a craft mat because mine is horrible and I didn't take care of it and so I used worn lipstick uh, distress ink and then I sprayed some SEI tumble dye which is like it doesn't have a color name but it's kind of a bubblegum color um, I also sprayed some Heidi Swap Primrose and then used some sugar spun sugar maybe uh, distress ink and so I just got a little cup of water and a brush and I'm just kind of making a little uh, not in any sort of technique, but just kind of using where I think my picture will be. I just put some paint around it um, using the brush. And that paper is from the Pseudo Calico kit from last month, I believe. So now I took a piece of cardstock that comes in a pack at Michael's and I took some pool party ink by Stampin' Up! And I'm using this grid uh, stamp by Kaiser Craft. And I'm going to put the picture in the middle so I don't need to stamp the middle, but that's good enough for me for now. And the title is going to be kind of on the bottom, so I'm going to put the picture towards the top. And the picture is, I kind of think it's funny just because my face is really weird. And so I'm just strange like that, that I would want to uh, scrapbook a picture like that. But um, the pictures of David and I leaving uh, from our wedding, and so... Um, I guess I was just really excited or whatnot. I don't know. But I um, wanted to go ahead and scrapbook that. And I used black and white just because of all the color that I'm using on the layout. So I've taken the triangle punch from Hobby Lobby and some washi tape. And I knew I wanted to use the washi tape. And so I went ahead and put that down to see kind of where I wanted it. And then I'm going to go ahead and start adhering the triangles which I already did and I already sewed down so <clears throat> now I'll place the other piece of the washi tape down at the corner and then I'll go ahead and adhere the whole photo down sorry you guys don't get this to see the sewing because I don't have a little small sewing machine and so it would just be really complicated to try to um, to try to film that but so now I'm taking some embellishments and I used some Heidi Swap paper for the triangles and so um, that was all the serendipity pack. I'm trying to use it up since I recently bought that. And then these are some chipboard pieces from the Amy Tangerine, her previous collection. I'm trying to figure out what else I want. I really don't want to add a lot of layers. Um, I'm, the last few layouts that I've done, or the last couple of layouts I've done, um, just in my scrap room have been, whoa, that was weird, have been, um, had a, have had a lot of layers, and so I just wanted to try to stay away from that, and I feel like when I use paint and uh, embellishments around the page, I would rather just stay away from a lot of layers, and sometimes I do both, like I like both, but I just didn't feel like doing it this time, so um, I've taken some stickers from this Amy Tangerine Remarks sticker book, and um, I found a couple that I thought would work, and so I put one in the left, or the small right hand, or the, the lower right hand corner, I'm sorry, in the, and then I took a couple to put in the corner of the picture. And then these are some ink and twine enamel dots, and then I'm using some enamel dots from Michaels as well. Or is it twine and ink? Or, twine and ink, sorry. <laughs> And then I didn't think I wanted anything else. And so um, this is pretty much going to complete the layout. I actually end up taking photos of the layout the way that it is. And I wanted to try to add something, but I was just like, I just need to stop. Um, and then I also took photos after I had added some black ink. So those will be coming up. So you'll see one photo with the, with the page just the way that it is. And then you'll see another photo with the black ink. So let me know which one you guys like. Okay, thanks so much for watching. Have a great weekend.